so after that they took off again. Right. Do you flock in for us? I can just push that across towards me. A little bit of your right hand down, straight ahead on your wings. Squeeze in the power. Don't lift off. Come on, a little bit more power, a little bit more, a little bit more. That's it. Don't lift off. Ease off the power now as the nose comes over the top. Do you flock back out towards you. That's it. First gear. That's it. Straight ahead on your wheels, Kim. And the beauty about this is, is you can see you've got a little bit of space and you can look at the, you always look at where you're going to be next and you can realign yourself if required. That's not too bad to be honest. That's it. More or less, just keep the wheel straight here and just let the suspension take it all out for you. feel where the weight shift. So have you got a night off tonight or are you going home and then going to work? Uh, I've got the weekend off though, but it's a whole day. Ah, that's literally what you had. Now just take a little bit of lock off as it's coming around. That's it, all the way there. Because the camber will naturally draw the engine down. Straight ahead for us now. That's it, you've got it. All in that steering wheel, dead straight ahead and welcome to 27 degrees. A deep lock wheel. It probably has done, but the sensor just hasn't picked it up. It's alright, I will have it. <laughs> See, this feels a lot less. When you're driving? Yeah. Because you're in control rather than being an out of control passenger. It's a common uh, common thing. Oh, See where did block dropped out? And as soon as I threw it back in again, it stopped the opposite wheels from spinning. Back out towards you on that. Now, let's come back out again. So, taking a lock off, leave the wheel there, diff lock in again. A little bit to the right hand side. A little bit more right, a little bit more, a little bit more. Straight ahead. And just hold on to that one. And your dad will see how near this ground gets to. Ooh, and you might just hit that cobble stone. That one there. Well done. Do you flop back out? Second gear for us now. You see, where literally, if you just get the right line, the edge of the tyre just hooks on the top of the tarmac. Right? right, and then they realise that actually it's now just a 300 pound pile of shaft. <laughs> Deep lock back in, kidder. That's it, keep your wheels dead straight for us, Adam. Fantastic, you've got it. Just let the car walk itself down. And if you were in the pickup now, it would be bump, 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 bump on that pickup on the back of these springs. Great to put to a stop. That's it. So we don't need that. It's, yeah. it's absolutely fine. So holding that steering wheel nice and level, it should go back for you. So again, we're using that little bit of power. So don't lift off the on the brake until I say ease off the power jet. So you've got your right foot on the brakes and your left foot on the clutch. Mm -hmm. So if you find the bike point with the clutch pedal, that's it. Now we ease off the brakes gently. Does the clutch hold us? No, yeah. so a little bit more clutch. That's it. Ease off the brakes again now. I think that's got you. You're over the throttle, fully off the clutch pedal. A little bit of power, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Don't lift off the power, a little bit more. Hold it there for you. Super. That's absolutely super, Peter. Ease off the power now. That's it. Ease off. Fantastic. Just keep coming backwards until you see the top of the steps. Then you've got a reference point. Great clutch to a stop. Back into that first gear. Over the top. So your feet are off the pedals in good time. And we're going to go all the way down straight up the other side. All the bonny blue flowers are out. I haven't got a clue what they are, but they are quite nice to look at. Give it a boot full of power. Hopefully, you watch. This should be the time it makes me feel like it. That's it. Just a little bit to the left, just to keep the bumper away from the bit. Straight ahead. Now second gear. That's it. Easy. A little bit of power now. Power, 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 power. That's it. Go on, don't lift off. Keep the power on. Go on, keep that power on, because if you were spinning the wheels now, you would ease off the power. Are you wearing a traction control? Just get in gently. Yeah. Ease up all the power now, it's for you. Deep lock lever back. A little bit to the left again, just keep in the middle. So you're basically giving yourself a little bit of leeway and just that little bit of safety margin. And just at the point you can see where you're going, 
the view disappears. You've been quite good actually, because everybody by now has tried to lean forward and look over the bonnet, <laughs> but you haven't done that, you've resisted that one. Feel where it's holding all the way back, diff lock can come out, down to the left hand side, as I say, diff lock.